Hey, it's your girl Jay Medina, and you're about to check out an interview I did with Terrence Dean, the author of a very controversial book called Hiding in Hip Hop. This is a book where he talks about some of your favorite artists or beasts and actors that you think are a gay. Well, he's claiming that they are gay, so you're definitely going to want to check it out. Jay Medina, Terrence Dean, and of course, my brother, DJ Jack the Ripper. Check it out. No, but you know what? Terrence got good reason. He's been traveling all over the place. I can co-sign for him on that, okay? And it's all because of this new book that he has out, and it's called, go ahead, Terrence. Hiding in Hip Hop, on the down low in the entertainment industry from music to Hollywood. Hmm, interesting. Now, you're going to have to break down that title. Go ahead, what's the book about, baby? <laughs> well, the book is about my life as a, as a former down low man in mm -hmm. the entertainment industry um, as it relates to, you know, um, music and Hollywood when I was, you know, working with MTV, you know, Spike Lee, Keen Ivy Wins, um, just with the list just goes on and on and on. And I just talk about, you know, how there's this pervasive subculture, this gay subculture that exists within hip hop that a lot of people in the industry know about, but a lot of people who are not uh, familiar with it are unaware that this industry, that this subculture does exist. So I talk about that in the book, you know, how um, many artists, um, for instance, you know, rappers, celebrities, you know, actors and, you know, especially, you know, and those who are behind the business, you know, entertainment executives, I lead a double life where they may have a chick, you know, a girl, mm -hmm. or maybe marry, but they also have a man as well. They have a boyfriend. Wow. And, um, right. and of course, to, like, not the knowledge of the female, these dudes is living pretty much straight lives during the daytime, and then at nighttime, <laughs> they're out with you. With a thong. <laughs> with a thong on. <laughs> Why are they they ain't necessarily with me, though, but, they, but a lot of them do have, you know, Don't. they have somebody, Terrence, a dude on the side. I, I read your book. You was getting a lot of dick. <laughs> All right? You better stop. I read the book. You was getting it popping, babe. You was getting it in, boo-boo. What? Don't front. All well, right? I did a little something, but you know, I, but you know I, I didn't do too much. I was trying to make sure, you know. I'm good. But like I said in the book, I was looking for a monogamous relationship. I really wanted to just be with one person settle no. down. People definitely, I mean, you know, with the title, people are automatically going to assume, oh, my God, this guy is outing a massive amount of people, like, in the industry. But there's an, there's an actual story, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, right. you read the book, they really get an inside look into your life. And because the dude, he was molested when he was younger, oh, you know shit. what I'm saying? Right, nah, so it's like, right. and, he, and he puts that out there, you know what I mean? Okay. Yeah. And, I mean, he didn't front on that. He spoke about that and how that just kind of, like, fucked you up, you know what I mean? Because were you interested in men prior to that or... Did that kind of like set you off? Yeah, that was that was the that was the that was like the the catalyst right there, that moment right there when um, it was a male next door neighbor who you know sexually assaulted. It was me and my cousin at the same right. time, so it wasn't like it was just me. He did he was doing he was like molesting both of us. Right. So you know that you know at that prior to that, no, I never even thought about being with a dude. I didn't even look at dudes in that way until until that incident occurred, and I was like, okay, well, what does this mean? Like, am I gay or? You know, why, what did I do to cause this or create this, and why did he touch me? So it right. did start me, you know, to question and wonder and you just start to think about, you know, those types of things. Right. But, you know, like you said, you know, the book is a really good read. You know, I want people <laughs> to understand, like, you know, I changed a lot of the um, celebrities' names in the book because I know you, you it's a very name, difficult process you didn't to name come any, out. You didn't yeah. name any names, but you did So drop. Russell Simmons is gay? <laughs> What happened? He got quiet. What happened? Did he hang up? No. But you, but you all are you all are very savvy. You all work in the business, and I think oh, a lot okay. of people who read the book they'll be able to figure out who I'm referring you, to. You, in the you book. Definitely so Kanye West is gay. <laughs> <laughs> You definitely need to play Inspect the Gadget with the book because oh, okay. he doesn't name any names. I didn't read the book. Sorry, I didn't read the book. No, but it's, like, it's like the it's like the it's like the the the, the, the hip hop version of the Da Vinci Code. <laughs> okay, wow, that's the okay. nice way of putting wow. it. You know what I'm right. We right. we gotta figure out whose ass you crack. No doubt. We right. gotta <laughs> pretty much. You know what I'm saying? No, but Terrence, check it. Um. So wait, oh. just real quick. So you you have relationships with like rappers, like well known rappers? Yeah. Mm. Like it's sold a lot. And, of and, and, and their music is currently played on the radio. Oh, right yes. now? Yes. Right, if we think. guess, can you, you can you say Soldier Boy's gay? <laughs> <laughs> So but there's R&B singers as well, and then you know there's oh, actors. Damn, yeah. right now. He mentioned one in the book that had me just like, yeah, yeah, one that opened up for Jay Z back in the day. In the day. Hmm. Yeah, and, um, my boy Corey. I talk about him from. Oh, Chuck Christian. He <laughs> gay. Oh. Wow. Uh oh. <laughs> so wait, 
wait a minute. So you have relations with these like rappers and these artists that like sold not like just like you know they just had a little buzz like they sold millions and millions of records. Yeah, they they uh-huh. yeah, but their music is currently played. Like you hear their right music now. all the time. Hmm. Let me think. Right, right. And he also talks about females in the industry that's on the low too. Exactly. Yeah, you talked about like how uh-huh. Queen Latifah right almost beat up a chick outside a club. <laughs> what? Uh-huh. <laughs> I said there was a chick huh? named Sheena. Yeah, <laughs> I but name yeah. Sheena. That was, a good, that was a good guess, though, right, Terrence? <laughs> <laughs> nah, but everybody knows she gay. Come on now. That's like a given. No, yo, everyone, we, everyone assumes that she is. She gay. She, buy, yo, she doing Papa Wheelies on Bushwick <laughs> Avenue on a fucking bike. She gay, yo. Yeah, but she's an abusive lesbo. That we didn't know. You know so wait, Bow Wow's gay? <laughs> Cats exactly, that we know. Exactly. You did. A, you worked on a lot of movies. Where were some of the movies you worked on? Tyler? I worked on Crooklyn. I worked with Keenan Ivory Wins on his um, night night talk show. I worked on. Uh, the um, Wayne Brothers is gay. <laughs> <laughs> one of them. <laughs> one of them. Two. Who? How many? Three. All right. Yeah. Can you say uh, one of them gay? Because there's like twelve. So is so, one of them gay? At least Wh- one. Which one? Uh, is I there mean, at least one that's gay? The is there one that's gay? Yes. Oh wow. shit! All right, if we give you the first letter of his no. name, can you give us? Can you or no? Come on, Terrence. Marlon is gay. Marlon. Oh, yo, he is mad flexible, Bobo. Wow. He is. Oh Damn. shit. So wait a minute. So these artists will come to MTV and then on the low they just give you like, here, call me, and they'll give you the number and shit, and then you just go. No, but you know, but like you know, we we all seem to know each other. You know, okay. who travels in the worst circles, like. But t- yo. You, shut up, Jack. Um, okay, nah, nah, if you didn't know, these like they have like these little clicks and they have like these right. download parties. Oh, is that right. true? Yeah, everybody says that. Like I always hear that. Like is that there's a secret society? Like yeah. they go to this little club and there's like niggas in cages or whatever the fuck. No, elephants, no, no. no, no. Not even like that. He's talking about like download parties where like in a specific individual's house and that's oh, where they all link and it's like. Right, exactly. So that, that's that's going on. Yeah, exactly. You know, like you know, like like if I have my own spot, you know. And uh. I, I call and feel my, you know, my friends over, and they invite their friends. And next thing you know, it, it turns into like a jump off where everybody oh. just, you know, it's just have, you know, balls and cock everywhere. Exactly. Oh, and man. You do, and you, and you do you. You find your corner. You find your bedroom, corner. a little spot you somewhere. You find your hole and get it popping. <laughs> so, um, so, Thomas, what's been the overall feedback of your book? Well, well, like you said, you know, I think well, the good thing is that a lot of industry people have responded positively. Like. You know, a lot of the um, online hip hop websites, uh-huh. you know, have been very positive and very in the forefront of like bringing this, you know, dialogue and this, and this, you know, this communication forward and saying let's talk about this. Like it is, it does exist. Like people are, you know, like you know, let's not be afraid to talk about it. Right. Um, people in the industry, period, have been you know, encouraging me. They've been very supportive. A lot of people who are in the book, I talk about, you know, they've I've, they've called and they, you know, you know send emails of their support and love let me know like you know they they stand behind me i think people who are fans are the ones who are more shocked yeah. where you hear a lot of the it's either i love it or i hate it because right. they and i think it's because it is a shock to people for some people they're like oh my god you know and how can we talk about this or you know this whole like this gay like i don't think people realize that gay can exist in hip-hop like i think they don't think that you know, for some reason, because it's, it's such a uh, macho, you know, thug, gangster image oh. and culture that they don't think, oh, they take it in the real, yeah, they take it in But I think people are going to be very shocked. So Pharrell they, is gay? <laughs> when they read the book okay. and they see that mm-hmm. it's going to be a very, it's a very thug, masculine, you know, I got body counts. I just, you know hustled and you know did what I had to do to get where I am now. Have you um have you gotten any negative responses from like people in the industry that are gay? Have they come to you and been like, yo, you better not spit my name. You better not say. Have you gotten anything like that? Only one person, and he's really? in the book, and I talk about him. But he's an R and B singer. Right, right. Um, so what? Are you like now banned from like the cock parties, or you you good? You still yeah, good? Yeah, you can't go over there. Are you? They, is they, are they are you gonna do your you? own like your own parties now? <laughs> your own promoters? You gotta go look for right, your own right, promoters right. now. But he's good though now. You know, but no. you getting extra. You getting you getting. Right. But now, nah, thank thanks for calling. I mean, it, it would have been great. If you would have been here too, so like that we could talk more. But face we gotta to go. Face. Yeah, yeah. Like, the time is crazy. We had a lot. Um, but Pharrell is gay. <laughs> No, I didn't no. say nothing. I'm not. Na- I didn't name any names. Oh, okay. Now he married. I'll, I'll give you this. I'll give you this. Oh, oh, there is a oh, rapper okay, okay. out of the South mm. who has a current re- record out now, <gasps> oh, and it's hot. Little Wayne is gay.